Hey you guys. Once again, I'm quite excited to film this video today. Um, I've been saving so many of these items um, for so long, actually, waiting to film with them. And I've been really excited about this one. Um, the second item and this item I've been most excited to use for a video. So this is the soft-spoken version of my kind of hot pink color theme. I have an entire playlist actually of color themes been doing them for quite a while and they're really fun so if you ever want to check out any of the other color themes that I've done I do have a playlist of them. I'll try to add this to it. So there's a no talking version if you prefer that. I try to make no talking and soft spoken versions of most of the videos that I do. Welcome to you if you're new to my channel As you can tell, this first item is, it's like a toy for kids actually. Um, I borrowed it from a friend of mine. And it just makes some of the best sounds. But I'm going to move on to another item. And um, I'm really excited about this one too. And this is what inspired the entire theme of the video. It's a little like makeup kind of travel bag made of this kind of plastic material and I have been searching for a bag like this for video for you guys for quite some time. I love the sound of these kinds of bags. So whenever I went into, say, a Marshalls or TJ Maxx or something, I would always try to see if I could find something with this, this kind of plastic. I finally did, and I believe I got it at Marshalls. Of these kinds of bags are just like glorious to me. I did use this in my um, recent video that was one hour of tapping only and so I, I did use this in that video as well as one of the items. What I had been waiting for was to film this video with all the different hot pink kind of colors together. And if you guys like the sound of this, I'll try and use it in some more videos in the future. Maria from Gentle Whispering has an awesome video with some different purses that have these this texture to them. I believe it's like three different colored kind of purses like this or bags like this I should say. And I'm totally with her in loving these sounds. I, I bet a few of you like them too. You should check her video out though. I don't know what she would have titled it, but it's Gentle Whispering, um, and the person you guys probably know, Maria, from that channel. She's one of the largest ASMR channels, and started in the very beginnings of the ASMR kind of genre on YouTube. She's one of the mothers of ASMR, I would call her. Anyway, maybe Google not Google, on YouTube, go to the search. Gentle whispering, like, bag, 
bags video. Maybe it'll come up. You can see a couple different color bags. So this one has a zipper. I just love this kind of plastic. And actually, I think I will use it for a travel bag for myself once I film this video. I'm actually going on just like a one day trip tomorrow, just with some family, just like a one night thing. And um, typically I don't really have like a travel bag. I just kind of, I don't know, I just like throw it all into my bag. I like, um, I have like a little case for my toothbrush. And like, you know, like my shampoo, little bottles of like shampoo and stuff like that. But I just like kind of throw them into my bag, with like in like a plastic Ziploc bag or something like that. So I think I might use this one to contain things in case they open and that sort of thing. I'm, I'm looking like at what's next here. Okay. I like to vary up sounds. So this next item, they are like Mickey, Minnie Mouse ears, I mean, in a bow. That's some kind of a hot pink color with some white polka dots. And it's a plastic. It's got a bit of a texture to it, so you can really hear that scratching, scratching sound. black plastic kind of headband attached to it and actually um, there's it has a bright light that comes on if you don't want to see that go ahead and close your eyes for a second but there it goes okay it's off now so it's just like a plastic bow that's got polka dots and light up lights inside of it so the little ones in my life love to just put this on their heads and walk around try to put it on my head and walk around or have me walk around with it we do have one in purple as well we got these like i want to say it was like a, a, like a store up a game place where like you get tickets and like we got to get this for the tickets that we got something like that like we redeemed our tickets from playing games and got this and a couple other funny things that were like dress up type things like mustaches and stuff things you could use for like a photo booth kind of silly things like that playful things like that is made from like a foam type material let's see you can kind of see in the no talking version I was digging my nails into the foam and you can see that they you know they slowly disappear but they could still see the remains of them just a bit and this is just a part of a Toy, like a little foam puzzle with different numbers and seven is the hot pink color of course it's got a bit of flowers everywhere different colors on there but in the background is that hot pink color and the top is a bit um it's got like a um uh, what would this be i mean it feels like some kind of harder material and I don't know quite what to call it not quite plastic yeah I honestly can't think of what to even call it the bottom is clearly like a foam but then they've put on top of here some like a harder piece of material that's still a bit m malleable it makes a bit more sound than the 
them. So this obviously is a piece piece of a bigger set. I actually got this at the Dollar Tree. It's a really great toy because it gets like really good um, because it teaches good fine motor skills for children. I try and get those little pieces together, but the foam and they can't break and they can pop them in the mouth because babies like to just put anything in their mouth. <laughs> but it's a good toy. It's got numbers and anyway, just for one dollar, it's like one through nine. Okay. Next I have a candle. It's also in this very hot pink color. If you do like the sound of these candles, these Bath and Body Works candles, I, I'm, um, I just recently filmed a video with a bunch of different candles from there, so you can check that out. But this one is in, is called Cactus Blossom, and it's got this grey vibrant pink, and then the top of it is silver, and it's got Bath and Body Works kind of written on it here and then on the inside it's a really really great scent really like really fresh and floral and sweet let's see the fragrance notes are cactus flower petal sun-kissed coconut vanilla and fresh sparkling lemon yeah, I can really, all those scents really come through and make a great blend of one single scent. There's also an, um, another channel that I've been really enjoying, ASMR channel, um, called CC ASMR, C-I-C-I -I ASMR, I believe. And um, she's got a, a Bath and Body Works haul that I really enjoyed with some candles and scents like lotions and soaps and stuff. And, um, yeah, I like her style. You can check her out. So this is another plastic bag again. I purchased this for this video. Again, it's not very common that I purchase things for videos, but recently I have been purchasing more things as I see them and I'm like, I'm learning over the years what kind of sounds you guys like and the things that like would be worth actually purchasing for a video as opposed to just like using that I have or borrowing from someone. Sometimes I pass something and I'm like, oh, this was from Dollar Tree, so it's like so worth it for the sounds that it makes. And I'm sure I can pass it on to a little one in my life who would like a pink kind of pencil holder for their school, starting school in the fall. So it's like, you can see it's quite, quite shiny. And it's got three kind of holes in it, so you can pop it into your folder and just put your pencils or erasers and markers and things like that inside. When I was little, I, yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed things like this. When I was preparing for the school year, I liked getting everything all ready. folders and my papers and pencils and such. Okay, so this next one is actually these little tiny post-it notes that are also quite hot vibrant pink and I just love the sound of peeling them off as well as this kind of paper sound 
One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got two there. video with post-its now. These are just the tiny post-its and they've got all sorts of kinds of post-its out there. So those are the... Oh, we've got two there. Do I have two? I do. And the others that are doubles. Let's see if we got any more doubles out there. Looks like not. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. That's number seven. Number eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. There we go. Okay, next, so I actually had this hot pink tissue paper and in the last video I had the no talking version I actually took this hot pink puffy paint and kind of squirted some on and then kind of was opening and closing the paper so I want to see it's dried now what kind of sound it makes as I pull it apart it's just going to rip let's see yeah I think it will just rip actually Ooh, that part's still wet. Okay, so it, it just really ripped. I wasn't sure like where it was in the drying process. So I just want to give you the sounds of the puffy paint kind of coming out and squirting on here. So this is the little tube. down the see. I'm going to put it right up to the mic. I have a mic here. Let's see if we can hear that. It kind of squeezes at the end there. So we've got a bit of this hot pink puffy paint. I used this for a project about a year ago. And I just had a bit left of it. So we keep it a bit longer. It's a little bit left. So it kind of has a nice sound. We fold that tissue over. 
and then open it back up. Pink inside. Because it's peak on pink, it's a bit hard to see. But for my nails for this video. It actually came in a pack of four that kind of fits like the four that are this size and they actually have like a top that comes and like sits on top of them, the top white part and kind of collects them. These stick inside of the top, I don't know how to explain it, but that's why it doesn't have like a name or brand, that the brand is on this like top that fits on top, the top of four little covers. Um, it's not like the greatest polish. It's um, not as good as some of the other kinds, but um, a friend was had received it and didn't want it, so they passed it on to me because they know I always have love having different colors for videos such as this when I need some hot pink. So I've got the hot pink here. And yeah, it was fun getting this bright color on. And honestly, I don't even know the brand. I can't remember. But I wouldn't really recommend it either, so <laughs> that's okay. Um, I do have this one more little ball. Not quite like the first one. I used this in a video not too long ago. It also makes some great sounds. A kind of bumpy, rubbery texture. a kid's toy. I actually have to give this back to someone who left it here. Not left it here, like I actually had it here for some little ones in my life. But um, I've had it for like a couple of years now because they, they're, they're with me often. Um, they kind of pass this stage in life where this is not really something they'll play with. So I need to pass this back. What sound do you like better? You've got this one. For me, I like that one better. But I like them both. I'm curious which one you guys like better. They're very different sounds. Okay. Okay, and this is a Play-Doh that is hot pink. Play-Doh inside and um, this has obviously been played with quite a few times. So let's 
bring all the players out on stage. Okay, let's get all our hot pink all together. Which sound did you guys like the most from this video? I'm curious. first put up my, like, my first video. Um, I, I think I, it was called Minty Fresh, is that right? Minty Fresh, yeah. And I did, like, a colour theme of, like, kind of, like, minty colours. So, like, winter greens and, like, icy blues and things like that. And I called it Minty Fresh was the theme name. And I just remember getting an email from someone who had watched the video, um, who had, I don't know if they were a sort of subscriber or became one because I, like, I, it was literally my first video. It was the most sweet and helpful, like, email ever. The person just said, hey, like, hey, I liked your video, and a tip is to, to, to have things of different textures in the videos, to have different sounds and stuff, because I think I had had maybe three or four items of the, I don't know, eight or ten, maybe even half, five of ten, were glass, like a glass sound, like that. And it hadn't occurred to me that, like, they all sounded really similar, like, and, like, it didn't give as much variation and, like, interest to the sounds and such. So I loved that suggestion and that the person took the time to kind of say, hey, like, this could help out. And I've always thought that when I make videos now of that person's comments. I always try to do lots of different textures so that the interest of the sound stays. Like each sound can give you new tingles and such. Sometimes if it's the same sound the whole time, it's not as like tingly in a sense. And it, that's just, you know, I, I, I tend to agree with what that person had said. That's my experience too. So I was really appreciative of that comment. And it's very much affected the way I gather items for my videos. So thank you. If you are out there, let me know. Like if that was you, let me know. I would love to get a comment from you and know if that was you that sent me that email. Because I can't remember the name. I could look it up. I can't remember the name. You really blessed me like that really helped to take the time out of your day to write to like a new channel like who does that so nice and the nail polish and last but certainly not least the puppy paint And that was like, I want to say like, is it four years? It might be four years that I've been making videos for. And so that was my first one, it was like a colour theme called Minty Fresh. So it's always been fun to do different kinds of colours and like, yeah. Okay you guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. And hope to see you guys next time. Bye bye.